My name is uh, Gwyn Dryerstart. I was head teacher at Denby High School until August 2004. I was born in 1939, so I started school in uh, Ysgol Rongoch in the infant section, which is where the law courts are now, in about 1943. And uh, it was, of course, during the war years. Um, what I remember is um, the blackout. The, the school was um, dark and the windows permanently covered in paint or in some kind of a blackout cover. I can remember the impact of the American soldiers when they were stationed uh, in Denby. And one of the things that the Americans had was plenty of uh, sweets or candy as they called it, and of course in particular chewing gum. And that's something that uh, we'd never had. So we'd go around chasing Americans and asking for chewing gum and uh, any gum chum was the, uh, was the password for that. I can also remember uh, refugees uh, coming in from Liverpool and Birkenhead and they always came to school. So my class had uh, local children, of course, in Rongoch and also a number of refugees. Now, one of the things that I remember distinctly was that a siren would go, but it wasn't the town siren to um, tell us there was an air raid. It was um, the warning in the quarry that they were going to blast and uh, when this siren went, uh, the refugee children used to dive under their desks. And that's something we thought was extremely funny because um, we didn't understand that they'd gone through some bombing in, in Liverpool or Birkenhead. But um, it wasn't until I was much older that I realised what they were doing and, and why they did it. I can remember very clearly also the uh, VE Day. That's Victory in Europe Day, where there were street parties, uh, as there were in all towns in the country. And um, I can remember thinking two things. One, that we would have white bread. People used to say to me, oh, well, when the war's over, you'll have white bread instead of this grey, dark and ugly coloured bread. And I expected the day afterwards to see white bread on the table, but that didn't come for a long time. And I also expected to see my father home. But um, he was uh, in the army, he was stationed in various parts of England, but he didn't return home for a few months uh, after that. But I fully expected him home uh, the day the war ended. Mm -hmm. 